All right guys, welcome back to part three here. 447 yards, part four. And as you guys can see, there's a bunker down there on the right and there's another one to the left as well, but big fairway, just gonna let it rip here, no wind. I got 133 left. Everything plays a little bit away from uh, us right here, so it's gonna land kind of hard and roll out. Just gonna hit a little knockdown wedge and try and put a little spin on it. Started right side of the green, drawn back. This looks shot, really good. Ooh. Oh yeah. Ooh, oh yeah. All right, big cat, give it to him. All right, hit another good drive. We got 122 yards left. I'm gonna go with the approach wedge and uh, see if I can get inside Mikey. Doubt it. Came out of it a little bit, just like he said. Oh, it's in the bunker on the left side. Got 100 yards left, gonna go lob wedge. And yes, Marco was 40 yards behind me. 20. Go <laughs> down. Nope. Right. Oh, just landed over the pin. Yeah. Had some spin on it though, and uh, he's probably got a 30 footer coming back. Nope. All right, I hit my first good shot of the day. I got about six, seven feet. I'll try and make a putt today. Big Mark ends up about 25 feet just past the pin. Pretty good shot. And Marco is in this bunker looking to have some fun. Caught it just a little thin, but he's out. He's got about 20 feet left. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. It's going, it's going. Come on. Oh. Oh. God, look at that thing roll out. Great putt. Mm. All right guys, part four, 367 yards. This one's gonna be turning to the right. And as you can see, there's a big bunker out there on the left and the, the right out of bounds comes in pretty tight. So you can't really cut the corner too much there. And if you go right of that bunker on the right, by about 15, 20 yards, you're probably gonna be flirting with it. So something just over that bunker in the middle and uh, should be good. Ripped. High draw. Headed for the bunker on the left. Bounce in front of it and then. <laughs> down the middle with a little cut. Just like he called it. It's gonna be perfect. Oh man, looks like you pushed it to the right. Nice drive, Marco. Mm. God, he put a little pop on that. Down a bit. Good ball. 97 yards left, we're going for the make. Stop dicking around. All right, there we go. Looks like it's middle of the green. It's gonna run out. An F. <laughs> My putting's been atrocious. And you guys can hammer me in the comments. What are you doing? lingering around. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Snake <laughs> oh, I thought that scares him. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. At least I didn't make a fool out of myself. All right, another beautiful hole out here. Part three, 183 yards. Playing a little bit downhill. And you guys can see just a ton of bunkers up there. Pin looks like it's in the back and kind of to the right. So pretty tricky pin position. Something left center here is gonna be uh, Kind of the ideal spot, I think. Ah, heavy. Get up. Oh, it could be good yeah. if it's uh, enough. Oh, that's... oh. Yeah. Right bunker. Nice ball. He did coming. play that high draw. Keep coming. Get up a little bit. It's just left of the pin, around the front, middle, part of the green. Right. Good shot. Start in the middle of the green with a little fade. Get this looks pretty good. Get up. Get up. Oh, got over. I think it's gonna be about 10, 15 feet. It's a 
double crossed it. It's going left. And pin high, just in the rough on the left. It's kind of rolling down though. All right, there's another view of uh, that house that's up there on top of the rock. I think it's like a $30 million house, dude. It's insane. Just uh, absolute mansion. The guy owns the whole mountain, Casey said. Must be nice. You good? Was it recording? Hey, can you hit that back, Mark? Right. It wasn't recording. So Brian's over there. He's got maybe a 15 footer down the hill. I ended up right here. Got 25, 30 footer. It's Mike's second, Mark's second shot, so he's coming up for par. Good roll. Not far, Mike. Nice up and down. Welcome. Oh, I almost missed it. All right, we're on hole 16 and wow, this is a par five, 539 yards all uphill. Looks like there's trash all along the left side of the fairway and the right side. I think it's both hazard. Um, that bunker out there, let's see, yeah, right there is uh, not reachable. So somewhere right in between that and uh, the fairway is where we're aimed. Oh, he crushed it down the middle with a little fade. Okay. To perfection. Yep. Position A. Fairways and more fairways for Marco. It's gonna kill Casey. Start, right? Started up the right side. It's headed right at Casey. Do we get a discount if we do that? <laughs> and I think it landed just in front. Fisky. Ripped. Damn. Straight down the middle. Drive of the day right there, boys. Oh. Turn. Oh, this is head for Casey also. Oh, he's going right at him. 265 up the hill. Going with the three wood. I pure to just but just pushed it to the left a little bit. It's headed towards that left bunker. Oh, come off. Uh, Alright, so this is where uh, Mark and Mike both ended up right next to each other. <laughs> and the crapper. <laughs> This guy's got a hybrid. I don't know what he's doing, but uh, go hard, man. Yep. It's a custom built hybrid. Tiger rule. <laughs> Just to know when he gets killed. Oh. Coach is gonna play it smart. Oh, you pure that out of there. Right up the left side of the fairway. That was that was perfect. I have no idea what this is gonna do, but I'm gonna have fun with it. Yeah, all right. Came out a little bit to the right, but that's fine. Yeah. B just hit a rescue uh, at the pin with the little fade. I think it's in that right side, green side bunker. Bunker? Yeah. yeah. All right, I had to lay up out of that uh, kind of semi-hazard or waste bunker. Uh, so I've got 80 yards. I'm just gonna hit a 60 degree, try and uh, play a little fade in there with as much spin as possible. This looks good, just a little bit left to the pin. Yeah, I think it's a good shot. All right, a couple of good shots. Mark just uh, is on the fringe right here, I think. And it uh, looks like I'm just past the pin about four or five feet. Let's see if I can actually make a four footer. And we got Marco, who is in the kind of green side bunker, but he's got to carry it pretty far. And the ball's not set up very well. That's a tough shot right here. But he can throw it into the bank right here and let it just kind of fade away towards the pin so anything left would be okay. Good. All right. He's probably got about 30 feet left. <laughs> oh, good effort. Oh. All right guys, last part three of the day here. 203 yards playing straight into the wind. 
as you can see there's a big bunker up there on the left hand side and the green looks pretty skinny in the front where we're going and then it kind of opens up as you go in deeper so the best here is going to be to the right side of the green and letting it kind of funnel down Goodbye. hooked left Start the left side of the green with a little draw coach closest to for 10 bucks it's got to be on the green though right yeah of course okay Started up the right hand side, it's kind of coming back a little bit. Looks pretty good. Uh, oh, 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 just a little bit short. Oh, it's right at it, but it's got to go a little bit. Oh, and he's on the green. Oh, it's feeding towards the hole. Oh, he just swooped one in there, perfect. All right, so Mike was right there in front of the green, just one yard short, if that. And then I ended up right here. Got maybe like a 15 footer down the hill. And then Mark was backside of the green over there. We'll just give him a zoom in. Little. Screens are so fast. <laughs> Good effort. Left himself a nice easy uphill. What? Got it. Got it. Oh. oh. <laughs> we are on hole 17 and wow again. This is a par four. It's 449 yards. Looks like there's about 100 feet of elevation from uh, us to the fairway. The bunker along the left hand side is about 240 and the ones along the right hand side are about 275 to probably 310. It's a slight dog leg to the left. As you can see, there's a ravine right in front of the green. So I think we're gonna end up with our drive just before that. And it uh, looks like the pin is in the middle, surrounded by bunkers. What a fantastic 18. hole. This is hole 18, by the way. Marco just piped one down the middle Look at that butter with a cut. nice little baby cut. Mm. Wow. Pumped down the middle too. M3. The nice little draw. <laughs> he doesn't even watch it. He walks off. Hey, your tee flew over my head, by the way. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Beasty. Mm. Beauty. Man. Straight down the middle. You got me on that one, buddy. Oh, <laughs> uh, you up. wanted to prove me wrong there, I think. Look at the bite in the little dog in there. <laughs> <laughs> This is the first fairway bunker of the day, last hole. <laughs> Guys hit every fairway today. Yeah, it's been good with the driver today. I got about 195 yards left, and I'm gonna go with the five iron. That's what he's working with. He's gotta carry that ravine. Not a, lot of, not a lot of green to the right to mess with, so I think he's gonna end up a little left on this. Oh, he took it right at the pin. Go in the hole. Oh, what a great shot that was. Looks like he's got like 12 feet. Yeah, that was fantastic. 179 into the wind. I'm just gonna hit a hard seven iron. Try not to go too long. Looks like it's pretty steep. So um, anywhere on the green is good. This looks really good. Hit high with a nice little draw going right at the flag. Oh uh, yeah, good shot. Just under the flag. All right, guys, I got 157. Yeah, I'm 20 yards ahead of Mike again, so that's all that matters. <laughs> Beesky finally got me on the day, so it's let's all good. See, let's see, actually, it was 22 yards, I think. Yeah, close enough. So that's where B. Oh, there he is. Okay. Oh, wow. He just hit a great shot in there. Looks like it's all over it. Just left of the pin, probably about 15 feet. Beesky's not going to give you any yardage, but he had about 150 yards. I think he hit a nine iron kind of heavy, but it's on the green and probably about 25 feet. Not bad. Ah, uh, guys, this has been an absolute pleasure out here. Look at these homes right on the 18th hole here. And you got that big one up there. I'd like to sell a couple of those a year, huh? Yeah. That's gracious. He said about 30 mil for that house up there. Yeah, I believe it. It's insane. So we got uh, Brian and Mark, I think, down here. Actually, I'm not sure. We got a couple balls down here. 
and uh, another one right here. I think this, and that's a TaylorMade too. I think this was me right here. Oh, he did it. <laughs> oh, buddy. Great three. Oh, he did it. He did it. Oh, buddy. Oh, good stuff, guys. Mark, thanks for coming out, buddy. Oh, man, pleasure, man. Good stuff out there. Yep. Good stuff, guys. Coach. Good stuff out there, coach. Oh, to, always a pleasure. Way to finish no, off. Fun. Everyone hitting the green on the last <laughs> yeah. hole. We look like players at the end. A couple of birdies out of Marco and uh, Mark over here. Hey, Team Mark, that's how we roll. That's right. <laughs> oh, beautiful course out of here. We're going to have to come back and do some more desert sure, golf man. out here. Oh, it's a treat. It's way to go, yeah. man. It was yeah, beautiful. we loved Bighorn. It was awesome. The conditions were fantastic. We had a great caddy with uh, Casey. He really helped us out with some local knowledge, and the, uh, the course was just so pure all yeah. day. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button and follow us on Instagram and on Twitter and uh, drop a comment down below. We're going to be doing a giveaway in this series. Uh, thanks to Mark from the Club Fix. Uh, make sure you guys check the link down below. We're going to have all the details for you. And uh, it was a pleasure, boys. Yeah, yeah, let's thanks, do it again. Man. Good yeah, stuff for coming all right. out, Mark. Thanks, yeah. All right, Mark. So what's the giveaway that you want to do? So we're actually going to do a free fitting for anybody at the full bag fitting at the Club Fix in Costa Mesa. Or it'll be valid. We have a Club Fix here in Palm Desert that we opened up a year ago. So um, click below on the link, and I believe that Marco and Mike will pick the winner, and we'll get that taken care of. Appreciate so, it, man. Yeah, Thank no you. No worries. Thanks.